Tonight, a man is in jail accused of robbing a gun store in Northern Virginia and trying to get away on a bus. This all went down yesterday afternoon, shutting down a section of Wilson Boulevard. That's where we find our Nana Saintu Bonzu with the latest on this investigation. Nana? Yes, the scene here tonight is much different compared to yesterday afternoon when police say a man walked into the gun store over here behind me, armed and with a ski mask covering his face. Well, that is scary. Scary to see the street outside his job filled with more than a dozen police cars. It started with just one. We're like, okay, someone got pulled over. Then it was like five, and then there was 30 all at once. Arlington County police pulled over a Metro bus on the corner of Wilson and Danville Thursday afternoon around 1.30. They got into the bus with a big weapon. They were looking for a man that walked into Nova Armory and stole firearm and ammunition. Police say a 22-year-old was wearing a ski mask when he entered the gun shop. An employee asked him to remove his mask. He ignored them, took the items, and walked right out. An employee tried to stop him, but the man threw a punch before heading out the front door and hopped on this Metro bus on your screen. It went from zero to 100 in about five minutes. Mohammed tells me he can't believe what he witnessed. All these streets were shut down. Last summer, Fox 5 DC did a story on Nova Armory moving to this new location. Some were excited and others had safety concerns. One woman said the location could attract crime. The example she gave is very similar to what happened on Thursday. If somebody gets on Metro, comes here, you know, knows that there's a gun store in this area. Get in, get out, get back on Metro, and nobody will be able to do anything about it. But in this scenario, something was done. Police responded within seconds and made an arrest. While some who work in the area aren't comfortable with the gun store. So I don't feel like I'm safe. Others say it gives them a peace of mind. Honestly, I feel a little bit safer with our neighbors because I know they're armed as well, and if we have ever had any problems, they're two seconds away. Now, police say that suspect is in jail tonight with no bond. He will appear in court next week for his arraignment. Now, we did go into Nova Armory to try and talk to the manager to get a statement or additional information on what took place yesterday, but they denied and asked us to leave. Back to you guys.